okay. So so let, let's get into into what's going on these days. And I kind of want to cover this first because by the time this comes out, it's already going to be happening. But Takashi Six Nine is about to be sentenced. It's supposed to be next week, which by now is probably going to be any day now. By the time this comes out, and there was a letter from the feds to the judge asking the judge for a reduced sentence based on Takashi's extreme cooperation in the case. Uh, everyone got ridiculous numbers of years. 20 years here, 7 years here, 15 years here. Everyone got convicted. Everyone either blew trial or took a, a, a big plea deal. Uh, and it looks like he, he may walk away or he may get a real life sentence. How do you feel about that whole thing? Uh, I feel like they gonna probably give him uh, cause he did some, he did some uh, Sammy the bullshit, so they gonna probably give him uh, five years credit for time served, and uh, he'll probably have nine, ten months left, you know, if not free in a halfway house, you know. Yeah, that's what that, that's what that's what I think the judge gonna probably do. Yeah, because I mean, he don't have court. points in the feds. Like he don't have points. Feds go by points. He don't have points in the feds. It's like he's a rookie. You know, even though we look at like six nine woo the woo, he's not. He's not. He don't have points in the feds to where he been there two three times, and that's what they sentence you off. And he cooperated. Oh, yeah. I mean, he's not just cooperating, but he's expanding on questions and, you know, giving details. And, and he's bringing people into, the, into his testimony that weren't even asked about. Trippy Red and Casanova and all these guys got, got thrown into that testimony. He just, he just, I, I just feel like he just, you know, he got to a point when there and there when he, you know, he, fuck it, I'm a rat. Uh, they gonna look at me like a rat. I'm gonna take everybody down, man. Fuck it. I'm gonna take everybody down, you know. When he put Cardi B in there, I'm like, what the fuck? Somebody text me, you know, they be ready for me to go off. Somebody DM me. <laughs> this motherfucker just put my girl Cardi B in there. Oh, puss ass nigga. <laughs> it was the same motherfucker saying, I don't know, he probably should have read it because they did that to his people. People be confused, man. You know, but I just think he got he got to a point where he got he got pissed off in that motherfucker, and he was like, "I'm just gonna take everybody down," you know. That's how. Uh, well, from what I understand, he was ready to cooperate on day one. I don't think it got to a point. Yeah, but when you get in a place like that and motherfuckers ain't supporting you. You get anger in you, you know, and that build and that and that builds that anger. You know, the first day he went in there, his anger wasn't where it was by the time he got to sitting in that motherfucker, and all that lifestyle left and all this shit left. You know what I'm saying? And the motherfuckers who you feel could reach out to you, who you feel showed any loyalty to reach out to you. They ain't, going, they ain't reaching out to you. That's how you think, but ain't nobody reach out to your motherfucking ass anyway. You in the fed. You know, ain't nobody finna reach out to you and write you or do shit because you in the feds. Nigga, all that shit is prescribed, the mail and everything. You'll have, you'll have them indicted. And I just feel like he took it as, okay, this motherfucker ain't say free. Six, nine, would want, I watch when I get to court. You know, that, that's how I feel. I, I, I'm a pretty good judge on character on people, you know. That's how I feel. He got he got pissed off. I've never seen a free six nine hashtag anywhere. That, that, that was non non existent. Uh, okay, so let's just say six nine gets out. He hits your line and say, hey, "Boosie, I want to do a song together." Nah, I, I ain't doing no fucking song with him. I, you, I, they already trying to say like I got something against him. I don't have nothing against nobody, bro. I just said what I said and I bagged up. I just said he was a rat. You know, like, hey, I ain't, you know, like, I ain't on no, I don't wake up thinking about no fucking 6'9. 6'9 <laughs> ain't on my mind like that. 
I just said what I said, you know. I just said what I said. I would not do a record with him. That's that that'll be that would be some bitch ass shit if I did a record with him. Now when he was hot, I wanted to do a record with him. Fucking right, I wanted to do a record with him. But when he sold his soul, you know, I, that was it, you know. That was, I, I live by codes, Vlad, you know, and and I'm gonna stick with that.